Where does Steph Curry rank all time? He's in the top 10, beyond a shadow of a doubt. Beyond? Now, T-Mac, I was telling us, I don't know why you're looking at me like that. <laughs> uh, was it like this yesterday? I just want to set the table. Was it, well, yesterday he was 12? Yesterday he was right outside the top 10, yes, sitting there at 11 and 12, sitting there at 12 to be exact. But what happened between last night, T-Mac, and this morning is he won a finals and a finals MVP. Mm. And when you win accolades like that, mm. the highest accolades you can win in a sport, you move up. So where is Steph Curry? Yeah. He's top 10 and he's not 10. Oh! <laughs> that, that just sounded good. That just sounded good. I'm about to say. He's top 10 and he is 10. Okay. <laughs> um, MJ, one. Braun Braun, two. One. Magic, three. Kareem, four. Mm. Russell, five. Duncan, six. Mm. Kobe, seven. Bird, eight. Shaq, nine. And Steph Curry, who kicked out Akeem Elijah one, slides in as my 10 spot. Akeem Elijah one was previously at my 10. I will allow a quick explanation. Mm -hmm. MJ, LeBron, Magic, Kareem, Russell, they need no explanation. Tim Duncan, higher than Kobe, obvious reasons. Tim Duncan over the course of three different decades, 90s, 20s, 2010s, all around beast, defensive beast. Kobe truly needs no explanation. Five, three with Shaq, two by himself, by himself in quotes. Beast, RIP to the great Kobe Bryant. Larry mm. Bird truly needs no explanation as well. You know what Kobe was doing in one of the toughest eras of basketball, what Bird was doing in one of the toughest eras of basketball, 80s. Now you got Shaq. And Steph. Shaq may be the most dominant player in the history of the game, Shaq and Wilt. But Steph, too, is dominant. It just looks different. He's dominant from the three-point line. Shaq was dominant from right next to the bucket. Shaq changed the game. Steph changed the game. Dominated both of them. It just looks different. Shaq I have at the nine spot because, obviously, Shaq was a significantly better defender than Steph Curry. But Steph Curry revolutionized the game like Shaq did. Akeem got to get kicked out because Akeem, though he had two chips, he only had two chips. Two finals MVPs, that's why I had him up there at my 10 spot. But now Steph Curry, he enters in as the 10 spot. I truly see no flaws in this list. I like the list, actually. Right. Oh, well, 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 don't leave me hanging, man. 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 Like me hanging, man. I, I, listen, I'm not mad at that list. I, I actually love it. Um, oh, huh. Huh? I do. No. Huh? Mm -mm. No, no who? No Will. No Will. No KD, no Hakeem, not, but, not even no, he removed them overnight. Like, like, hold on. Here's my thing. I'm the bouncer at the club. Hey, what's up, Steph? Oh, let me get in. Nah, man, all y'all ain't getting in because all of those championships, those three, oh, now four, I'm sorry. You're not getting in. You're not passing the Hakeem because Hakeem already been in here with two. You already should be in here if it's about team championships. Oh, no, no, I just got a finals MVP. Let me in. Let me just, I'll come back for y'all. I'm coming, I got a finals MVP. Guess what the bouncer's going to say? Nah, dog. Hakeem got two of those, too. Why are you getting in now and Hakeem got to get out for you? So if you're going to replace Hakeem, you should have been replaced him. How do you replace him overnight just because Steph has more team success? He already had more team success than Hakeem before yesterday. All Anybody? it takes to get Anybody? into the club sometimes, T-Mac, is one small change. I went to the Lila's, that restaurant right there off Santa Monica Lila. about two months ago. Yeah, I was I with my dog. Trying to walk into the Lila's with my dog. Dude at the door was like, hey, big dog, talk to my homeboy. He was like, hey, no shorts. No shorts allowed. It wasn't no monumental change. Mm. All I needed you to do was put on some jeans. <laughs> it wasn't no monumental change to get <laughs> Steph Curry in the club. All he needed to do was win a finals MVP. I didn't have him go change his whole outfit. I just said, hey, put some pants on. Yeah. I didn't have him but change you, his whole but, resume. But your boy got in. Did they kick somebody out because your boy put on some pants? You so, can't kick a team out. So we, we do not include regular season accolades like all NBA first oh. team. Uh -oh. All NBA. Mm -mm. I am. Of, I do. So if, if if you include that, then Akeem needs to be in your top ten. There you go. Here's a problem. If you're including that, then you have to include a you unanimous. How you, you feel that? You unanimous. Nanny. Unanimous Nanny. MVP Nanny. for Steph Curry. <laughs> That's my dog. So if you really want to start talking regular season accolades, yeah. now I might have to put Steph Curry even a little bit higher. How? Because Steph, how many unanimous MVPs do we have in N NBA history? Mm. But it's an yeah, Curry. It's, it's an MVP. <laughs> it, regardless if it's unanimous, it's MVP. Yeah. Right? I mean, let's. He can't justify the change. No. But he, he can't justify no. the change. But no. you know what, Mac? Before you so, even get it deep into this, Mac, 
Why don't you see a real list and tell me which His list you really were? Okay. In all honesty. Yeah, yeah, dusted and disgusted. Here we go. Marcellus Wiley, who looks like me, has a list. First of all, how'd you change Jordan and LeBron? I saw that too. You had LeBron at number one. Then he goes slight LeBron. Overnight? What did LeBron do last night? I'll... What did Jordan do for your boy? <laughs> oh, oh. <laughs> <laughs> the air autos be speaking. Okay, I get it. All right, here's a real list, Mac. LeBron James, Michael Jordan, y'all go fight over that. Kareem, Magic, Bird. Look at that top row. I that's, dare you. That's, man. Shaq, Duncan, Will, KD, Kobe. Ah, <sighs> where's Steph Curry on my list? I'm going to put him as high as number 11, as low He's as 13. At the door. Yeah, he's knocking, he's at, knocking, the door. knocking at the door. He's knocking at the door. Who can you take out? Now, Mac, look I at those lists. Talk about it, brother. It's it's hard because, I mean, these guys are arguably, you know, they've been the best for a decade. These guys, I'm talking about all NBA first team eight to ten times. Mm. You know how tough that is, right? Mm. And then they all have multiple MVPs, finals MVPs. Mm. Steph Curry has what? That's This is his that first one. one. That's first one. Got a short song. Right? They have multiple championships. He He's knocking at the door. He's knocking at the He's door. He's knocking at the door. That's good enough. Shorts and flip flops. KD, KD went there and, and, and helped them get two of those. Here's the problem. Thank you. The big, here's the thing. I like Sell's list. I don't hate his list. Okay. Because a very easy thing to do with Sell's list, I just got to find what name I got to kick out. That's tough, That's man. That's, well, all you I mean, got to do is find okay. out, like, who, who need to get out so I can get in? Who are you picking on? I'm looking at Kevin Durant, oh. T-Mac, and I'm looking at Kevin Durant, and I'm saying this. Oh. I'm saying, <laughs> you have no championships without me, Steph Curry. Who is it? But I have two championships, just as many as you have, Kevin Durant, Ooh. without you. Oh, well. So if I'm Steph Curry, not a Steph Curry, if I'm looking at the bouncer, because you know when you got to get into a club and they, they do this. <laughs> what do they do? Capacity. Y'all know, know what they do. Fire marshal. <laughs> Y'all know what they do. We had capacity. I'm looking at the bouncer because I got to kick somebody out to get in. I'm saying, wait a second. That dude, Kevin Durant, he don't even supposed to be in here without me. Because Kevin Durant's greatest accolades came because of me. So I have everything Kevin Durant has and some. No, Let me ask you this. Go ahead, please. Ask me whatever, big dog. Go you, ever, you ever played for a Super Bowl? No, sir. You ever played for a Super Bowl? Huh? National championship. <laughs> Matt, what'd you say? Huh? <laughs> <laughs> nah, not over here. So, so if if... Tom Brady is missing. Who, who's some two of Tom Brady's greatest weapons? Rob Gronkowski. Gronkowski. So if Randy he's making, Moss. if he's making, missing Gronk and who, give Moss. Me Randy Moss. And, and Randy Moss, right? And whoever they're playing against, who beat them? The the Giants. Giants yep. beat them, right? Yep. Like if he's missing his two greatest assets, yes, sir, and he loses, mm. wouldn't we say? He didn't have those who got. If he sir? had yeah, those yeah, two guys, yeah, absolutely. Won, yeah, like, won the Super Bowl. Yes, sir, what point are you making, sir? So, 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 so yeah. what I'm saying is, yeah, you, you you just said about point. his his first championship mm -mm. without KD. Mm -mm. LeBron ain't have two of his his two, guys. Two of his. Now they won they won the championship. I give them all mm -hmm. the credit, but. I mean, if he had Kyrie and Kevin Love, it'd be a different think, picture. It'd be, it'd be a different picture. Mm -hmm. But here's my problem, bro, uh, with all these ifs. I like it. I, and I like the tone. I'm, I'm just stating the facts. That's, That's a fact. They, they won the chip, but I'm just stating. In 2016, mm -hmm. what happened to Draymond Green in yep. game five when that was about to be a wrap? See, all these, we can't keep playing these if games. But I, if bet, you I it, bet you was one of the put guys put that was. Put your finger down. I bet you was one of the guys that was killing Draymond. Put your finger down and stop pointing at me. Mark, hey. Marcellus, I'm here. was he killing Draymond when he was playing oh, bad? I don't know, man. I don't Were you know. killing Draymond? I Were you? bet, I bet I you know. was the one killing Draymond when he was playing like, bad in his finals. I don't like, I don't like, I don't like, like I don't I bet you was killing like Draymond tone. when he was playing bad in this series. So now, all of a sudden, now you want to talk, bring up Draymond because ah! he got suspended in Good Draymond. Good point, good point. All That's now you want to so bring Draymond KD's up. So far, KD's still in the club. T-Mac, they played together. This is why I understand why we trying to always kick KD out for step. They played together, and KD showed them, hey, dog, this is me. I, I like. I, I love that we got T Mac see, here, see. America. I love that we got T Mac here for this conversation right here, Who's right better? now. Who better? Every now and then, T Mac. Who's KD. I Every now and then, oh, you might look like somebody the best player, and I feel it because KD looked like he was the best player. He looked like it. Here's what I'm gonna tell you. Here's what I'm gonna tell you. Ooh. Here's what I'm gonna tell you. <laughs> Stephen Wardell, Stephen Curry allowed Kevin Durant to do what Kevin Durant wanted to do. Wardell, Stephen Curry could have done this. Hey, KD, 
It's my team. No. So I'm going to be the ball hog, and I'm going to do what I want. No, but good. what did Wardell do? Wardell, he ain't Stephen war. Curry, said, hey, <laughs> KD, you a dude too? Go ahead and do your thing. Why do I say that? I Why do know. I say that? Mm. First two games. I'm going to keep it 100 with first you. First two games. Oh, yeah, 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 oh. First two games of Jordan Poole's playoff career. Do that 59 points playoff record first two games of career. Mm. Steph Curry sitting on the bench. He could have been playing. Sitting on the bench, like, oh, yeah, boy. Coming off an injury. Go ahead. He, but he, he came, First in, round came, of a series. In, came in the next game, dropped 30 points. First so round. Steph Curry's like, yeah, go ahead, pull. Do you think? Oh, post game intervals? Pull. It's all you. Because Steph Curry has the personality to say, I'm going to defer for the greater good of the team. Mm. Just like yesterday, I'm going to defer for the greater good of the team. Y'all need to stop holding Steph Curry's greatest ability against him because y'all selfish. Now go ahead. <laughs> <laughs> no. I, I, listen, he, he is. Uh, definitely one of the un most unselfish superstars, yes, right? Yeah, selfish superstars. No I, I give that to him. Go back to the series where they played in Toronto, right? Mm -hmm. Do you think Ooh. this this KD's out? KD gone. Right. KD gone. Now, mm. do we think mm. Steph is just sitting back and saying, "Hey, Draymond, go ahead, bro. I'm a, I'm gonna let you do your thing." Because yeah. Draymond was actually the front runner of MVP in that that finals series, mm. right there. You mm. do know that, right? Mm. Right. Defensively. Look at his Speak game up, five, Otto. game six Speak when up. he had Speak like yourself. 37, hit like six threes. Like Draymond was the front runner for that MVP. Love now it. Steph was awesome in the series, but Draymond on both sides of the of, of the of the court, he was phenomenal until Clay went down. Mm. Where Steph then? He, what happened to all that deferring? Anybody? Here's here's a problem with you all. Oh God! Now this is a problem with you all. What do you mean, you people? His, his, his analyst. <laughs> I love y'all as individuals. I love y'all as individuals. Okay. Love as individuals. Had the shoes. Great. The black with the blue stripe. <laughs> oh, he shoes. really buttercup in there. I love them. Um, <laughs> as, as individuals, I love you all. As but. analysts, atrocious. Oh, wow. Um, and here's why. Kevin Durant has shown who and what he is without Steph Curry. Incredible individual talent. Incredible individual talent. Went to the finals once and lost. Well, and then he lost in the Western Conference finals as well, too. Guess who? Steph Curry. So, incredible <laughs> individual talent, but without Steph Curry, Kevin Durant hasn't accomplished anything collectively. Okay. Yeah. Steph Curry without mm -hmm. Kevin Durant uh. has accomplished everything you need to accomplish. I said this, T-Mac, and I will say it one more time just because you're here. Just because you're here. You can tell the story of Steph Curry without Kevin Durant, but you can't tell the story of Kevin Durant without Steph Curry, and that's all that ever needs to be. Oh, you could tell the story of Steph without KD? Absolutely. I'm telling he this had, story. He, he helped them with two chips. He got two without him, sir. He has two without him, sir. He got two without but him, those sir. Two, let's be real. Those two without KD. Try and tell a Steph story without KD. You're not talking about him being a top 10 player. That's the problem. He needed Kevin Durant as that trampoline to get into this conversation. They were in the Hamptons yeah. recruiting KD. Yes, for and here's the tiebreaker to this conversation. Seriously, I, I, I hate that. be real about that. this. Why I you, hate that. Why you keep saying I hate that? What Kevin Durant did without Steph Curry. If I'm a baller and you a baller, we don't need to go about what I did independently of, with, without you. What did I do with you? So this is the tiebreaker. What did they do together? KD showed. I was a trump card. So your egregious statement on the first segment when you said it's hard to win a championship in today's game, KD proved you it's not. Because he went to a team that had previously won, what, 73 games in the regular mm -hmm. season, mm -hmm. right? And joined them. We're talking about one of the top five best players in the world at this time, mm -hmm. talking KD. Yes, sir. Going to join another superstar. No. That, like, that's not pretty... Hard to win. Because mm. when he joined that team, everyone knew. Okay. You want right. something? They want, they want something. Uh, right. Team Mac, man, it's unfortunate because the longer you talk, the more you'll talk into a trap. <laughs> and for the first time this whole show, he talked himself into a trap. Um, because Team Mac said this. KD joined a team that was already a superstar team with a superstar player. You realize know that? But you realize we haven't seen another player need a MVP to win a championship since 81-82 yeah. when Dr. J and Moses, Moses Malone joined forces? KD said, though I'm great, I need another MVP. Kawhi didn't have to say that. Dirk didn't have to say but that. Steph Wait a second, but sir. Steph Let said it too. LeBron didn't have to say that. He recruited him. Kobe didn't have to say Stop that. that D-Wade did not have to say... Uh, Shaq didn't have to say that. What are you mm -hmm. talking about? Shaq didn't have to say it. D-Wade did not want an MVP. <laughs> 
Shaq didn't have to say they it. Said Tim something. Duncan didn't have to say it. You got to go back to 81, 82 to find an MVP who said, I need another MVP to win. Steph has won without an MVP. Kevin Durant is the only dude since 81, 82 who had to join another team that already had a guy that won an MVP to win a title. But Steph said it too. He recruited him and he was the MVP. Draymond recruited him. Draymond <laughs> talked too much. Draymond, <laughs> me talking. I don't like that. He got his own podcast. <laughs>